Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here today. Today's video is gonna be a fun one. It's something I've wanted to film for a while. Um, I'm gonna be showing you guys my super quick makeup routine, the things that I'm gonna actually do it in two phases. I'll show you like my very basic if I literally have two minutes to get out the door. And if I have 10 minutes, here's what I'm gonna do. I wanted to leave it open because there's things that people, that other people value more than, you know, like I value bronzer very highly. And a lot of people don't. People prefer blush or just nothing on their cheeks at all. It's gonna be great. So before we get into it, make sure that if you haven't yet that you're subscribed to my channel, make sure that you also have ring the bell so that you can be notified when I upload videos on Fridays. Make sure that you're also following me on social media, which will be popping up right here below me. So you can follow me there. Okay, let's get into it. Okay, so I'm gonna get my phone so that I can time myself. What I'm gonna do is let's start out with what I would do for a two minute routine. Actually, I could even call this a one minute routine. Yeah. Let's call it that. One, and then like maybe my five to 10 minute, I, I don't know, it might be somewhere in between. I'll give myself 10 minutes and then see how it goes. So for my one minute routine, I'm gonna give myself two minutes, might be like a minute and 30 seconds. No, I feel like it's a minute. I'm putting, I'm setting my timer over here. I'm gonna, I think I am gonna do a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't need more than that. But yeah, if I wanna go out the door really quickly and look like, you know, natural, but just more awake, like I'm fresh faced, I mean, this would, be, this would definitely classify as a no makeup makeup situation. The only things I'm gonna do is I'm going to apply a tinted brow gel and I'm gonna apply a really lightweight concealer that I can just apply with my fingers. So my ones I picked today, definitely this is my preferred concealer for this situation is my Glossier Stretch Concealer. And today I actually also picked my Glossier Boy Brow in the shade Blonde for my eyebrow gel. And I like to put in a tinted brow gel that has some hold to it so it's gonna hold my brows in place. They're not gonna get all weirdly shaped throughout the day. They're gonna add some tint, make them look fuller, and we're just gonna brighten up my under eyes with this concealer. So I'm gonna set a one minute timer. Maybe I will, <sighs> what am I gonna do? Is I'm gonna call this two minutes. I'm gonna set a timer for two minutes because on a day like this where I have these large sits on my face, I would wanna conceal them a bit. I would wanna add some coverage there so what I'm gonna do is give myself two minutes to literally put some concealer on my under eyes, put some eyebrow gel in, and spot conceal these big ol' zits. I had this set out for when I do my 10 minute, but um, this is what I would use if I was gonna spot conceal my face. I would use my Bare Minerals Bare Skin Serum Concealer because it is really, really full coverage and it looks so skin-like, it's really hard to tell where I have makeup on when I put this on, it's really nice. So that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna give myself two minutes and I think it's gonna work out. Okay, two minutes. Ready? Okay, let me get everything ready, I'm stressed. <laughs> okay, ready, set, go. Now I'm gonna go in with some brow gel. I just now put the concealer down and let it, I'm gonna not talk. Oh, this is too much pressure. Okay, I'm doing okay. I have a minute and 20 seconds. One minute. Okay, going underneath my eyes, just with my finger. Okay, I'm gonna take my sponge and just really quickly go over my spot concealed areas. And if I have 10 seconds, I will curl my eyelashes. Two, one. Ha <laughs> ha! I added one thing at the end, and what I would do is just curl my lashes. If I'm not gonna put concealer in, um, if I'm not gonna put mascara on, I would curl my lashes just so that, you know, we kind of open up the eyes a bit more. So, yeah, that's what happened. I'm pretty happy with that. This sit down here is just so massive, it's pretty hard to cover up all that redness. I mean, that's fine, I'm fine with that. You can definitely still see the redness here and here, but I'm okay with that. It's a little bit more covered, but I also think that looks like a lot more natural. Like if we zoom in on my face, can you see that I have makeup on? I just, I don't think you can. I think my eyes just look a lot more bright 
and awake. Yeah, I'm happy with that. That was two minutes. Um, five minutes would be just kind of a variation of what I'm gonna do for my 10 minute. Um, if I had 10 minutes, what I would do is I would add a little bit more concealer coverage, kind of spot conceal all over my face again, add a little bit more coverage here, first of all. And then I would um, add something on my eyelids, just a really light one and done kind of cream eyeshadow that's really quick and easy to blend out. And I brought a few out here to mention to you guys. Don't know which one I'm gonna use today. But brought out my MAC pot paint in the shape Groundwork. This is a really, really great, just simple neutral brown. And you can kind of see it has a bit of reflect to it, so it's not like a flat matte. Um, looks really nice. Another super favorite of mine is the Kosas 10 Second Eyeshadows. Um, this is the shade Globe. This is great. It really does take 10 seconds to do my eyes with this. It's excellent. You just swipe it on and it's really, really liquidy and blend it out a little bit with a brush. Another good one, the Ilia Liquid Powder Chromatic Eye Tint. This is the shade Sheen, just a simple bronze. All over the eyes, kind of a thing. Similar to the Kosas, but it's a little bit thicker. Just swipe it onto the eyelids a little bit and then blend it out with a brush on the edges. You're good to go. Might take you a minute to do both eyes, you know? And then the other things that I like to use in situations like these, I use my Nude Sticks Magnetic Matte Eye Colors. And these are two of my favorites for these kind of situations. Uh, the shade Terra, which is just a light warm brown. You guys have seen me use this. Uh, I think I used it for the first time on my channel in my no makeup makeup video, which was like the second or third video I literally ever posted. So love this. And then another shade I really like to use is Fig. It's a little bit of a deeper brown. It's got a more cool undertone to it. Really pretty. I think today, because I don't think I've used this on my channel, I'm gonna use the Kosas 10 second eyeshadow just to show you guys how quick this is and how beautiful it looks. Um, so I'm gonna use that on my eyes and then I would throw on a little bit of mascara. I'm gonna use my Lancome Doll mascara. And then I would also put on some cream bronzer because right now I look really natural, but I think it's gonna, it really adds a lot of, um, it just makes you look a lot more put together when you add some dimension to your face on the sides with a bronzer. So I'm gonna use my Fendi Cream Bronzer in the shade Butter Biscuit, a really, really light bronzer shade so it's not too overwhelming. It doesn't take a long time to blend out, kind of a thing. And then, if I have time, we'll see. <laughs> but if I have time, I will add a highlighter. This is my Fenty Matchsticks highlighter in the shade Pearl because I can literally just swipe this onto my face and tap it out a little bit. And a cream blush, if I have time. Uh, and I brought out here the Rare Beauty cream blush in the shade Nearly Neutral. It's really great just to tap my finger into it, blend it out on my cheeks. So we'll see what I have time for. I also brought out here a brow pencil. Again, if I have time, which probably not, but this is gonna be a lot. I'm stressed. I'm stressed. Okay, let me think about the order I wanna do things in before I put my timer on. And so when I time myself this time, since I already gave myself two minutes for what I've put on already, I'm only gonna give myself eight minutes to just match the difference because I feel like it's unfair if I do 10 minutes when I already have a little bit of something on my face. <laughs> have regrets. Am I ready? I don't, I don't know. Truly, I don't, I don't know. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go. 75958, okay. I'm gonna add a little bit more coverage here and up here again. I'm just being really messy with this. I'm gonna messily spread this out with a brush. So messy. How much time do I have? Six minutes, okay, crap. Okay, bronzer. I'm gonna take a really big brush because I'm just throwing this everywhere. I'm going with some more mascara. Five minutes, oh gosh.
some eyeshadow below. Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit of, ah, Val, I dropped my brush, I dropped my brush. Blending that in, adding, oh my God, I can't get this blush up, but okay. Brow pencil. Three minutes. Okay. Those look terrible. Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit more mascara. Okay. I'm feeling good, I'm feeling good. Add some more bronzer. Two minutes. a minute. Okay. That scared the heck out of me. Okay. That was eight more minutes. That was a lot of time and I got a lot done in that time period. That's what it looks like. My brows are still a little messy. And I would definitely uh, take another second or two to fix those. But other than that, I'm not mad at it. Okay, so you can kind of see just how nice this eyeshadow is. It's just really thin and reflective and just like a bronzy color. It looks really nice. But I think this really shows that you can do a lot in 10 minutes and like, if you wanted to put a lip on, you could easily do that in the car or whatever, you know, kind of a thing. And also, you're probably wearing a mask wherever you're going, so it doesn't matter, does it? It doesn't. But here's my skin. I think it looks really, really nice, considering how quickly I did this. But just, I think I look really put together. Like I look, like I took some time to do my makeup and I did take a little bit of time, but it, you know, it really wasn't that much time. Okay, so, I mean, that was my 10 minute routine, I, you know. Just throwing on a gloss just because my lips were naked and felt dry, so I just threw on a gloss real quick. Anyway, so that is, those are my really, really quick makeup routines. If I have to get out the door in like 10 minutes or less, those are the things I'm gonna do. Like I've mentioned um, already, if I had somewhere between two and 10 minutes, you know, I might do a five minute routine where I might add to my two minute routine, I would probably just add bronzer or, you know, just add mascara kind of a thing. Just something else quick that would just enhance my face a little bit, make me look more awake, a little bit more put together kind of a thing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope this was helpful for you. If um, you know, you're know you somebody, if you're a mom or if you're somebody who just has to get ready really quickly often, if you don't have a lot of time for yourself, I totally understand. Um, that is the situation with a lot of people. But you know, there are days that that's happened to me where I'm like, oh crap, I have 15 minutes to fully get ready. I have to pick out an outfit and get, and get my makeup on and I only have like five minutes left to do anything to my face. So these are the kind of things that I would add. So I hope this was helpful. Please let me know if it was down below in the comments. Um, and yeah, and I, with all that said, hope you enjoyed this really quick video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.